first the flu, now norovirus is spreading like wildfire across the country. The Centers for Disease Control is warning of a new and particularly harsh form of the stomach illness that affects 20 million Americans every year. I checked with local schools and hospitals today and found out there is no significant outbreak here and they are doing all they can to keep it that way. We teach them to count one, two, three, four. Six-year-old Diamond Mills is counting seven, eight, nine. On staying healthy by washing up just the way her teacher told her. Kill germs as much as possible and keep things clean. It is a constant battle this time of year, and especially now that experts say there's a new norovirus out there. This strain is a little harsher in that sometimes you can get a little sicker, may last um, a few more days. Chesapeake Health Director Nancy Welch warns this bug is nasty. It causes severe nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and abdominal pain. Some are calling it a super bug because it can hang on to surfaces or food for several hours. Unlike the flu, there is no vaccine and it can get you more than once. You really have to clean, clean, clean. And because the germs can spread through the air, too, if a child gets sick, say, in a classroom, the teacher must act fast. You really have to try and bring everyone out of the classroom to so get real good cleaning. Bring in your bathroom, isolate that bathroom if you have two bathrooms to so do good cleaning. And use bleach. It's the only thing that will kill the bug. We let the bleach water sit and air dry. Don't forget door handles, your computer mouse, telephone, anything frequently touched, and this. 14, 15, 15. It's still what doctors count on most to stop the spread of germs. Now experts say soap and water does work best, but if there is none around, hand sanitizer will help. But here's the catch. It has to be alcohol-based, so check the label.